Most people in life are looking for how do I make a life worth living in return with having. One of the hardest parts of having faith is practicing being willing to listen to the Holy Ghost who gives us lessons and training in a lot of ways. When we're not in the house of God, meaning we're not practicing our faith to the explicity of our beliefs, God is not well perceived in other people's lives. What I mean is that we're not representing Jesus, we're not representing Muhammad, we're not representing whatever Veda that floats your boat and doesn't sink your ship. But what I mean by that is that people are always evaluating us based on the words we speak. Tonight's little episode of me having to evaluate something was a joke that turned into more insult to me than anything else. Because if you're wanting to know something from me, then you just ask me. But most people want to say, I'm doing this for you. And the answer is, no, you're not. You're playing words at me that you know upset me, to interfere with me. And I'm just sitting peacefully on a one by one meter square. When I made this video earlier, God had some things going on, meaning the world changes, people shift, emotions change on a dime, and you never know what the Lord God is thinking is not true. Jesus Christ, the one that most Christians believe is God, has been filled into a parenthesis in most people's life. Meaning when they get the word God who is God, they immediately go, Jesus, in parenthesis. And that's not true. Because most people make their technology God. Most people make their social media God. Most people make their men's fellowship group God. Most people make their husband or wife a God. And most people don't do what they need to do to actually believe in God. 